Toho is a series of video games from Japan created by a man who goes by the alias of Zune online. Toho's world is called Gensokyo, and it's sort of a fusion of different types of mythologies, though there is a bit more of an emphasis on Japanese mythology specifically. You have vampires and mansions, samurai and cherry blossoms, moon rabbits, like three different versions of Hell, and more. At the center of this world we have two constant protagonists, Reimu and Mursa. Reimu is a shrine maiden who solves problems whenever they appear, and those problems are generally connected to how the game is set up. For example, in one game, a scarlet mist covers the sun and causes the weather to become crazy. Reimu goes out to find who's causing the mist to appear. Mursa, meanwhile, is generally in the stories of the games for more selfish reasons. She doesn't have a duty to protect the world, so she goes out to find the source of the mist in order to become a more powerful witch. As mentioned before, characters are generally based on different types of mythology, and they also pull from aspects from both Eastern and Western culture. In one game, you might be fighting against the time-stopping maid, and in another, you might be fighting against the bunny who can shoot lasers from her fingers. In terms of presentation, Zune partially made Toho as a way to distribute his music because he's a fantastic composer. That's why Toho's music is really good. Toho's wide range of characters, addicting gameplay, and awesome music generated a huge fanbase, which Zune openly embraced. He's very generous with how he enforces copyright, and as such, Toho fan games often see commercial releases as long as they follow certain guidelines, and the Toho song remix scene is huge. Toho's influence is pretty big. It's crossed over with other properties like the Taiko Drum series and even Hello Kitty. There's also several Toho manga, both official and non-official, and there's a ton of fan-made animations and memes often associated with music, like Bad Apple and Marissa's Still the Precious Thing. With a wealth of both official and fan-made works, Toho is quite a huge phenomenon and a fun series to become invested into.